of 1958, there is only one thing bigger than Elvis Presley. The United States Army. Rock and roll singers aren't the only rebels stirring things up in the 50s. Hey, Johnny, what are you rebelling against? What do you got? Ask someone what the biggest problem in the country is, and they'll probably say juvenile delinquency. No, 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 I'm not a juvenile delinquent. Frankie Lyman and the Teenagers. On Saturday afternoons, I used to hang out in the theater just like this. Yeah, I remember my friends and I, we'd load up on popcorn, kick our feet up in the seat in front of us, and we'd watch Alan Freed's early rock films. Alan Freed was a disc jockey. He was often thought of as the father of rock and roll. Well, he's the guy who came up with the name. In his films, he was always playing that one adult whose heart was in the right place. He understood kids, especially how to entertain us. We're gonna really rock and roll tonight. And now, America's number one vocal group. Here are the Platters. Oh, yes, I'm the great pretender. Pretending that I'm doing well. I seem to be what I'm not. in movie houses, teenagers, black and white, line up for Alan Freed's incredible stage shows. For all who attend, these concerts are events to remember. This show featured the Cadillacs. After one of his concerts in Boston ends in violence, Freed is indicted for inciting a riot. Soon, rock and roll is being banned in cities around the country. What do you think of the mayor of Jersey City doing? Uh, I think he's a square, man. He don't know what's happening, that's all. Because rock and roll is cool, you know? Yeah, I see. I think that mayor must have been nowhere because rock and roll is cool, daddy, and you know it. <laughs> rock and roll is the most, and if they stop that, they ain't going to have no more music. That music sends me, man. It sends me. You guys dig that music all the way. <laughs> Many teenagers are as concerned as their parents with the public's conception of today's youth. 
these students are portraying what we consider bad taste in school attire and behavior. This student is wearing an ankle bracelet, dungarees, and dropped earrings. This student is wearing an extremely tight skirt and tight sweater. Open shirt, black jacket, dungarees are mentioned in the code as not proper school attire. This group is our ideal of the proper school attire and social behaviors of the Hicksville Junior High students. Mom, Dad, you didn't. A bra and it fit. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Say, Pop, where's everybody going? Uh, the young'uns? This is Saturday night, neighbor. The young'uns wouldn't miss their dance at the meeting hall. The biggest record of 58 is Danny and the Juniors at the hop. in the simple beauty and the profundity of the sentiment. Sketch. Be Bapalooba. <laughs> She's my baby. Be Bapalooba. I don't mean maybe. Be What's nonsense to some is poetry to others. Well, she's the gal in the red blue jeans. She's the queen of the... Jean Vincent and the Blue Caps. She's the woman that I know. She's the woman that loves me so say. Bibapalula, she's my baby. Bibapalula, I don't make my baby. Bibapalula, she's... Do you know how many musicians I used on Rock Candy, a two million selling record? Four men. All right, sure. With rock and roll, with you can... rock and roll, you can make money. Money don't get everything is true, but what it don't get, I can't use. I need money. My 1959 rock and roll is the hottest thing in the music business. But many people feel that rock is being shoved down the throats of teenagers by disc jockeys. Some believe that records are being played because somebody is being paid. The House Committee decides to investigate. We came to a mutual uh, dissolvement of the contract, uh, WNEW and myself. Uh, what about the payola charges? What payola charges? Well, that are rife in the industry right now. Have you ever taken payola? No, I have not. It was a matter of your personal integrity, I think you said? Correct. Do you th really think there's room for personal integrity in the rock and roll business, the way it's going? Why not? Can we ask you a question? Alan? Alan? The payola investigations leave Alan free to broken man. He will die destitute only a few years later.